for our military exhibit this year at the State Fair, we have brought in a very special artifact, and that, of course, is our Huey helicopter. When you think of Vietnam War, the Huey helicopter really is synonymous with that. So this particular helicopter actually is two different Hueys put together, and over the next year, we're going to do a full restoration. This gives us a piece of that history that the veterans who are coming into this exhibit see and they remember from their experience in Vietnam. When we think about the population of veterans that are alive today, the majority of our population, of course, are going to be our Vietnam veterans. We have about 100,000 of them here in Kentucky, give or take a few. So throughout this exhibit, we want them to not only see pieces of their own history, but also know that we're honoring a piece of that history. And so being able to give also young people just that information that they're not going to see in their history books. And most people who come to the State Fair may not go to a military history museum to see some of this. My goal here for the exhibit, one, is to honor, educate, and remember, to honor the sacrifice and service of our Vietnam veterans and their families, to, to remember, to reflect upon what all they have been through and those that we've lost. We have a POW exhibit. I want people to understand that we still have 14 missing in action from Kentucky. I also want them to understand there were eight women on the wall, not necessarily Kentuckians, but understanding that there are some special nuances that they're not going to learn in the history book. And then to, to educate, to make sure that we're passing this information, or as in Flanders Field's poem talks about from over one, that we're passing that torch from one generation to the next so that they can continue to teach their children.